Are you ready to transform your summer into an epic splash-tastic adventure? Say goodbye to wasteful, single-use water balloons and hello to the ultimate in reusable, eco-friendly fun with reusable water balloons. Check out the link in the video description to get yours on Amazon today. Richard E. Grant's daughter has tied the knot and, ever the proud father, he's keen to get everyone involved in the celebrations. The 67-year-old actor's only child with his late wife Joan Washington, casting associate Olivia, had a civil ceremony with Florian Herbst in London on Monday, July 8. In lavish style, their intimate nuptials were followed by a wedding breakfast at Scott's in Mayfair and a truly spectacular dinner at the iconic Ritz Hotel in London. Sharing a picture of the happy couple under an umbrella in front of the latter celebrity hotspot on a rainy day, he shared on X, our beloved daughter at Olivia Granted married Florian Herbst yesterday in a civil ceremony with only his parents and me, present. Wedding breakfast at Scott's and a truly spectacular dinner at Theret's London and sweet sleepover. Royally treated. Sick, taking to the comments, fans and famous friends were keen to offer their congratulations, with the likes of Fern Cotton commenting red love hearts. Zoe Ball wrote, congratulations to you all are hurrah for love red heart. Patsy Palmer added, Congratulations Balloon Confetti Ball Bottle with Popping Cork Heart Suit Heart Suit. The happy news comes three years after the family were left devastated by the death of Joan, who died aged 75 from lung cancer in September 2021. Saltburn star Richard, who married the dialect coach in 1986 and is stepfather to her son Tom, thanked everyone for their messages of support earlier this year. In a New Year message to his fans on his Instagram, he penned, Thank you to all my friends and followers on social media for the incredible support and love I've felt, especially over the last two years, and I've been buoyed up and hovercraft by your support and feedback. Wishing you, to every one of you, the finest health for 2024, and all good things to come. Richard grinned, yeah, baby, up, up and away. His clip ended with a video of lights and a lakeside scene and was captioned, Happy New Year. Pockets filled with happiness. Before then, he vented his frustration over former friends abandoning him after Joan's death. He said in a conversation at the Times and Sunday Times Cheltenham Literature Festival in October, subsequent to her death, I have had people cross the road rather than talk. Whether they think you're going to fall apart and you're an emotional wreck, I don't know. But I will never speak to them again. He went on to recall an occasion during which a couple who'd lived near his and Joan's holiday home in France ignored him when he waved. As I walked towards them they both turned their heads. I thought, F you. I felt I was being punished because Joan had died. They had never acknowledged it. Backslash maybe they didn't know how to deal with it. More, Gypsy Rose Blanchard announces that she's pregnant with her first child. More, 80s hip-hop legends blown away after Simpsons prediction from 28 years ago comes true.